down with the underground. I'm down with the underground. I'm down with the underground. Hey, what's going on, all my fans out there in UVA land? We are back here once again for another episode of UVA Real Talk. I'm here with the one and only, Joe Algieri. No on, insults man. today, you know what I mean? I'm in a good mood. You Thank know what? You. Thank you. Thank all right, you could use a shave though. We'll, we'll, we'll you know, yeah, you can use a shave. You no, know? listen, um, someone was watching, uh, they said that they like to see the ever-changing display of my facial hair, so I figured I'd change it up for him. Yeah, somebody just said it. So maybe next week he'll probably he'll get a he'll get a trim and he'll look a little yeah, different. Yeah, a little trim. I'll, maybe I'll look civilized next week. Well, let me grow and get your Grizzly Adams on. Yeah, you know. Whatever it takes. Absolutely. Whatever it takes. But listen, UBA, we had a lot go on this weekend. We are going to start with the Vixens Championship. And we have some highlights of what was an excellent excellent match and you know what? I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna let the ladies and their bowling ball speak for themselves let's go right into some highlights of the fixers championship with the one and only shannon sellens and her ever so competent opponent carla piera Hey, we're back, UBA TV. That was a great, great match that I am honored to have been there to see. And I must say, I must say both ladies bowled exceptionally well. You know, both caught some really bad breaks at given at important moments of the match. But hey, listen, all I can do all I can do is show love, eat some crow, absolutely, and congratulate the new and new <laughs> yes. UVA Vixens champion, the one and only Carla Pereira. Listen, girl, you did your thing. You shocked the world, you know? Yeah. I mean, I'm pretty sure there are a lot of people in your corner. You got a lot of fans out there that thought you could do it. You know, there are a lot of people who didn't think Shannon was beatable or capable of having a bad day. Hey, listen, any given Sunday, this is why we do this. This is why 
There are no paper champions in the UBA. This is why nobody in the UBA hasn't won their spot wherever they are. Cozy you know what I mean? strikes again. Cozy strikes again. Cozy strikes You've again. Been saying it for leading up to the match that you know it has broken many hearts, and you know it, stri it definitely it strikes again. But I do want to say congratulations to Carla. You know she shot me a very sarcastic comment on Facebook that I wasn't okay. showing her any love. Carla, it's all for you. This I told you you got a whole segment to yourself today. So I mean, I just hope that this victory for her really translates into a boom for the Vixens division. Okay. I really do. I just, you know. And let's just hope it's not short-lived. How about that? Because How about that? You earned your title. Okay, you're, you're the champ now. The I got to give you that. I got to give you that. Don't go in your next match and get swept. Alert. All right? Alert. You want to you go another seven-game thriller and win, lose, or draw? You show your stuff? I'm proud of you. Don't, don't come out here. Don't become a champ and then get knocked out in your next fight. Let's you see. don't do that. Where they do that at? Yeah. All right? I don't expect that from you, but I'm just busting your chops because you gave me a hard time. You know what I mean? But you know what? I did have a chance to catch up with Carla and talk to her right after her match, okay, when she won. Let's take a look at your new UBA Vixens champion, Carla Piera, right after the match. Hey, what's going on, UBA? Big Rod Dog is in the building. I'm here at Cozy Bowl where they just finished bowling. The Vixens Championship match. For the second time in a month, I gotta eat a little crow. You know? I, hey, hey, listen. Any given Sunday, a bowler can step up and and bowl better than someone else and have their day in the sun. And I am standing here with the new UBA Vixens Championship. And you know what? I, it was brought to my attention. Somebody said I might have been pronouncing your last name wrong. Yeah. So what I'm so so I'm gonna make sure I get it right and give the lady the respect <laughs> she deserves as the newly crowned UBA Vixens champion, the new queen of the UBA. I am here with the one and only Carla Pereira. Pereira from Virginia. Oh, I, I keep saying D.C. You keep Maryland. saying Maryland. Oh, it's I don't okay, know. So you in the, this is like little tri-state area over there. <laughs> you know, yeah, they're all close to each other. They are. But, um, hey, how you feeling right now? I'm feeling warm and fuzzy. Really, really? good. Yeah, really? I'm very pleased with my bowling. I think I okay. threw the ball really well. Had a little problem in the, what was that, I guess the fifth and sixth game? No, okay. fourth and fifth game where the okay. transition got me. Mm -hmm. But I figured it out, and we here. And I got mm -hmm. a new belt to take home. Mm, yeah, you want to get it. Go and get that right there and show the world. Show this, the world. This is coming home with me. Show the world. This, this is coming home with oh, me. Bell's taking a road trip. It's yes, like it the, is. Just like the Stanley Cup. <laughs> you know what I mean? The belt, the, hey, the belt's taking a road trip to Virginia. Listen, all I can do is say, hey, good bowling. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. I am extremely proud of you. You thank know, you, 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 showed, you. you showed a lot on them lanes today. And thank you, thank you, thank you. Got to hand it to you. They can't take it away from you. There's nothing anybody can say. There's no excuses that anybody can make. You, 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 everybody's got a bowl, and it right. is what it is. And, You're and right. today was your day, and you are on top. <laughs> the new. How'd I feel? Is it sinking in yet? It, it, it hasn't quite sunk in yet. It will in a minute, though, I'm sure. Yeah? Yeah. Right, she got a big Kool-Aid <laughs> smile on her face. I ain't mad at her. Because uh, it's hot in here, yeah, and I'm, I'm glad it's over with. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. I'm going to say it again, and I'm going to say her name correctly. Carla Pereira. Very good. The new UBA Vixens champion. Listen, God bless you. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank good you. Thank you. Good thank bowling. you. All right. All right. Back to you, UBA Real Talk. Finally, someone puts you in your place. Hey, listen. It is what it is. You know, I had a lot of faith in Shannon's ability as a bowler. Mm -hmm. And we, let's just say, let's just say, let's just say, say what you want, call me a sucker, call me, say what you want to say about me. You know, she won. Call her one. Does one match mean you're better than the person you defeated? No. No, not at all. Just like one game doesn't mean you're better than somebody. Absolutely. However, on this day. She was. She was the better bowler. She, she had the highest scores. She won. And today, as we stand here. You, Carla Pereira, DC. can't nobody take it away from you. DC. You know? 
you know, it is what it is. Virginia, she made it a point to say that too. Yeah, she's on DC Capital, Capital Punishment, whatever her name is, stupid team is. That's, but, a, that's, that's good. I'm sure you won't hear any, any yeah, feedback yeah, yeah, for that. Yeah, she'll give me a hard time. Yeah. But she did point out, she did make it a minute that she's in the, that area, but she does in fact live in Virginia. Okay. So shout Virginia. out to Virginia. Shout out to VA and to Carla. Now, Carla. Someone lurking in the You got rings. a bus or coming on your heels because now she has to bowl Crystal Franklin. Crystal Franklin. The Garden Foundation. The number one, the Garden Foundation, the number one contender for the title. And we all remember what she did last match. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She put up she put up some pretty good numbers yeah, oh yeah. her last match also. So that should be that should be an exceptional match. Can I that wait? time and date is to be determined. And um, they're one away from Battle Ball. Yeah, and yes, and they're one win away from the trifecta, the three way hard way, whatever you want to call triple it. Triple threat, the, the yeah. triple threat, whatever you want to call it, three the hard way at Battle Bowl. Yeah. Okay, the winner of the Crystal Franklin Carla Piera Championship match, okay, will represent the North. Will represent. The North the Vixens, North Vixens against the winner of our two Road to Battle Bowl matches. Yes, we have two Road to Battle Bowl matches which, still still coming up. Which at have Cozy to. we yeah. filled the second one as well. Yes, we did. Yes, we did. We have another spot, another the Road to Battle Bowl. Those matches are being have been set. Okay, we had another great seven game match go on in the one and only Cozy Bowl. Alexandra Stein against Marissa Lamb. Love Lamb Chops. Lamb Chops. Love her, it sweetheart. Went, yeah, she's a very, very nice person, very nice person. And another, it went seven games. These Vixens are coming to ball, And man. they're both, listen, these ladies are both throwing the ball phenomenally. But, Alexandra Stein. Pulled it out. Came out on top, she pulled it out in game seven. And um, now. She meets Danielle. June thirteenth, Melody Lanes. Oh, it's been set. I like that. Melody Lanes after the season tour match. Okay. So June after the, after the Metro season tour stop, at Melody Lanes, it's there you Danielle go. versus there Alexandra. You go. June third. You heard it here, ladies and gentlemen. June thirteenth, Alexandra Stein, Danielle Marino, Melody Lanes, approximately three four p.m. ish, right after the tour the season tour matches. Yep. At Melody Lanes. Oh, that should be a doozy. And the winner of that match earns a spot in the triple threat, in the triple threat at Battle Bowl. But you know, out of all of this, and we still have as well, you have Robin's match against Deanna at Old School. Okay. Yep, yeah, I can't say that. Get, look, get, I'm going to give all the ladies their proper due. Deanna crying. Okay. Robin Buscini. They are bowling. June, At June 21st, Father's Day. Yeah. Van Ness Lane. The card is set. Van Ness Lane. The card is set. That is one of the matches on the card. Yep. UBA Old School. And the winner of that match earns the third and final spot in the, triple, in the triple threat match at Battle Bowl. Or is it for the, the UBA spot? Vixens? Or is it? Or, or is it? There's someone lurking. Hmm. There's someone. There's someone. Reaping around the UBA. Hmm, the possibilities are endless. That can change the whole layout of that match. Okay. But that's not for me to decide. No, no. We'll just have to wait and see. That's it. But you know what? We're going to go into a commercial right now because we got to pay some bills around here. So we're going to a commercial and we'll be right back right here on UBA Real Talk. Buddy's Pro Shop. Videos by bowlers for bowlers. with the underground I'm down with the underground I'm down with the underground